my camera and lens have just gone for a swim in the river. I've already, uh, I've already had my, uh, my accident that always happens whenever I'm out with any other vloggers. My camera's falling on the floor and I've got mud all over my polarizer, but at least it hasn't gone in the water this time, so it could be worse. Good morning and welcome to the vlog. Uh, today I'm in the Lake District and I'm here with the great and good of the small to medium landscape vlogger community. Uh, we're meeting up at eight o'clock, I think it is this morning in Derwent Water and which I'm overlooking right now. But before we did that, or before we do that, um, I'm actually here to do a collaboration with Darren Knight. Um, I don't know if you've seen his vlog. If you haven't, you really should, because he's excellent. Um, but we decided to meet up. That's how you introduce a vlog. See? Right there, right there. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I don't know, you're right. I, I, I don't know if you've seen his vlog, but he's okay. Um, <laughs> uh, I don't know, uh, seriously, if you, if you haven't subscribed to him, then you really should, because he's, his, his style's really laid back and uh, he takes some excellent pictures. Um, so anyway, we decided to meet up and we've come up to Surprise View. Um, which was a bit of a surprise when I got here actually, because when you park in the car park, you have no idea of what's going to be laid out in front of you. Um, and we're taking some early morning landscape shots. So it's starting to rain now a little bit, but um, it's actually, I think it's added a bit to the atmosphere. It's uh, much nicer clouds now over the back there. They're much more interesting than they were earlier. And there's a bit of colour. It's a little bit brown, but I reckon I might be able to bring out some of the pinks in it. So I've switched out, I don't know if I'd mentioned it earlier, but I've switched out to the wider angle lens and trying to get some of these rocks in, in the foreground. Um, and yeah, so that's what we're doing here. But do you know what? I always do this. I spend most of my time chatting because it's just so nice meeting new people. It's, I'd, I'd much rather have a really good chat with Darren and a few of the other guys than, than actually get a good shot. It's, um, I guess that's part of uh, community. So yeah, but if there are any good shots, then I'm sure you'll see them at some point. So I've come down from Surprise View down back to Ashness Bridge, which is a very short drive, uh, but a quite steep walk, so I, I drove. Um, I, I do apologise if this vlog appears to be a little bit, uh, what's the word I'm looking for, unstructured. Um, I always find that when I come out and meet someone, I, I just enjoy talking to them so much that I end up not focusing on the actual vlog and the actual photographs and end up focusing on talking to them, which is kind of what it's all about, really. Obviously, it's not great um, if you want to watch and try and get some sort of uh, enjoyment out of the vlog, but um, it's very difficult. It's very difficult because, like I say, I enjoy talking to people. And Darren's really good company. He's a really top bloke. So, um, 
yeah, I just um, just haven't got round to doing very much vlogging at the moment. I seem to be doing an awful lot of talking and some photography, but not very much vlogging. But hopefully, now I'm at Ashness, I might do a little bit more. You never know. Now last time I was here, I was very much focused on shooting the bridge, which is obviously the main focal point and the reason a lot of people come here from below and from above. But if you look a bit further up actually, there's some quite nice falls. So I think I'm gonna have a little look at those. So something different from your normal fare here at Ashness. Um, instead of shooting the bridge, I'm shooting this little pool of water here and the waterfalls that are cascading as they come down the side of the mountain. Um, it's a really lovely clear pool. There's some nice rocks uh, underneath. I've got the polarizer on just to completely kill the reflection and cut through to those rocks. It's shooting at about three seconds, somewhere around that between one and three seconds, which is just nicely milking out the waterfall. I'm completely killing the sky. I'm going in quite close because the sky is very bland and also it's quite, uh, it's quite dark here. So the dynamic range between the sky and the waterfall will be quite severe. Uh, and we don't want to blow our highlights, do we? Um, so, so yes, yeah, so I've just eliminated the sky really and just got this little fall in the uh, top left-hand third. Uh, maybe a square crop, may not be. Should be quite nice, something a little bit different from here. So that's me done from here, along with Darren. I've got to say, it's been a fantastic morning. I mean, we're gonna head on and, and chat some more probably when we meet up with everyone else, but I've really enjoyed talking with him. He's a great guy and I really recommend you check out his channel. So especially if you watch, if you even if you just watch the one that he did from Thornham Creek with the lightning. Oh, I mate. thought you were gonna pick the other one. I thought you were gonna say, even if you watch the one with the cows. Oh, what's all the one with the cows? That's... So far this morning, I've just been referred to as the cow man. Not Darren Knight. Nobody knows me as Darren Knight. It's just like, oh, you're the cow man. Yeah. So, yeah. Or watch the one with the cows. That's a good one as well. So from me and the cow man, <laughs> I wanna say thanks for watching and see you next time. <laughs>